is a nail biter, I'm gonna leave a tiny little bit of space at the cuticle area so that way I can blend it in right now. And we're gonna flash it with our flashy lamp. Meow, I need a new one too. Then how are you? Designated driver. I can be your designated driver. I just need to learn how to drive. Uh, you don't know how to drive? No. I have a Tesla though. Mm -hmm. Valid. <laughs> <laughs> but I bought it mostly as a tax write off. Yeah. You guys, if you purchase your electric vehicles before January 20th, you will qualify for $8,000 credit from the federal government. But if you wait after, then it's gonna be next to impossible to get it. Hi, Max. Hi, Antonia. Hi. Hi. Hello. Her name is Asia Dunnis Chapman. Daddy is. Dunnis. Dunnis. Dunnis Chapman. Dunnis Chapman. Your dog, the bounty hunter's granddaughter. <laughs> Do you have a middle name? Right. Asia Ray. A lot easier. But does anybody call you Ray? Yeah. Really? No one calls I mean, by my last name. Oh, Asia Ray? Yeah. You don't like Asia Dunnis? No. Why? Because people mispronounce my last name. <laughs> How do they say it? Like that? Dunnis? Dunnis. That's because it is. Dunnis. <laughs> like, let's just go back, right? It's a lot easier. Dunnis. It's like that uh, sketch from um, Keenan and... What's the other guy? They used to have a show back in the day on TV. And he would say, is Dunnis here? Dunnis? Yeah. And her name was like Denise. <laughs> a A Ron. Oh yes, I've seen that. A A Ron, don't you be playing with me. Jabeka. <laughs> Jabeka. I actually happened to in real life to one of my customers, Barbara Mosley. She was a teacher in uh, Chicago, and the girl's name was um L A dash A. What is it? Ladasha. Ladasha? What? <laughs> that was her name, I swear to Jesus. Her name was Ladasha. And it was L A dash A. Her name was Ladasha. La Ladasha. And then another one that she told me it was the plus symbol. Mm -hmm. And then sun. Plus sun? <laughs> like plus? Like the, the plus symbol? Yeah. And then sun. S O N. Addison? Addison. What? So she really was using like math. Math. Math for her name. For her child's name. She said letters were enough. <laughs> I need to take it one step <laughs> further. Have you seen the girl with the longest name in the world? Uh uh. Her name is over a thousand letters. And her after like her mom named her, she um Oh, the state of Texas banned names that will not fit on the on the birth certificate. Really? Yeah, because her name was so long they had to make a special birth certificate because it was like 12 pages or something. And her name is like, I don't know what it is. I'll show you later. Like her name is really long. She has to like get her breath. She goes <gasps> when she's saying her whole name. Oh, I got a vanity plate though. Well, I'm trying to get one. Oh, Go ahead and put that in a vanity plate. Yeah, for my car. A vanity plate for the back, like the license plate. I want it to say something cool. Oh. <laughs> what does yours say? Is it just something random? Yeah, it's just You didn't want something cool. No. Why? Really? Is it expensive? I wonder if you can put bad words. Maybe. Oh, I don't think so. <laughs> because there's a lot of, like, I've seen ones that like, I feel like I'm playing like chess. <laughs> and then I'm gonna tell people like, oh, it's my last name. If they like say, oh, you can't have that. So I'm like, that's my last name. <laughs> but like, I've seen people that like abbreviated cuss words. Really? Yeah, one was like, F love. <laughs> like, <laughs> I wanted to say max and then four eights. Eight 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 eight. Cause that's good luck in Chinese. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
when you have the number eight um, three or four times, it's good luck. Really? Mm-hmm. In feng shui. So now I'm going to do a little coat of wonder on the inside. And this is going to seal that DIY gel and also create a really sleek, smooth surface. I love the crown. royal. Someone says I feel for Barbara because I worked for a pediatrician and it was baby boy or a baby girl. Mm hmm. And what was its name? Ladasha? Addison? <laughs> what? What's so funny? Um. <laughs> so <what's... laughs> Neither do I. <laughs> Your tag, Max, and four eights. It's just a silly way to say it. Max four eights. Oh! <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> I'm lost. Steven said that mother is ridiculous. That mother had a goal. She's like, I'm going to give my children very, very long names. But did you hear that little girl? She was. <gasps> That was fun. And then the world, uh, the town with the longest name in the world, it's in, I think in Wales. Really? Mm -hmm. But there's a place in England I want to visit to. It's called Shitterton. Shitterton? Yes. I want to go to Shitterton. Let's go. I wonder how far from London it is. <laughs> of what? <laughs> Doesn't it sound like a beautiful place though? I totally have said I'm being dirty minded today. <laughs> Antonio, you're gonna get this video demonetized. You guys, if we reach 100 views, we're gonna do a giveaway too. So make sure you like and share this video, post it in your favorite nail group, hit that share button. Let's try to get to 100. Oh, this is a cool song. This is divine. Have you ever seen The Little Mermaid? Well, I'm pretty sure you have, right? The OG version? Yeah. Ursula, the sea witch? Yeah. She was based off a drag queen. Really? Yeah, and this is a drag queen singing. God rest his soul. She went peace out. He had too big of a heart, literally. <laughs> I don't know what that disease is called, but his heart was too big and he went to out. How do you feel? Glamorous. Ready for whiskey rose. We're going to go in with good old golden smooth top barrels to begin to blend in that cuticle. Can you imagine writing that all out on top of your school papers? Oh my gosh. That is very inconvenient though. I'm lucky I had a short name. Well, I have a short name. It's just three letters. Even though I do have the name that is most common given to dogs. Yeah. Max. Yeah. But you know what? I don't think I've ever met a dog named Max. I think that's more like TV. TV movie. Very much so. What's your dog's name? Max. Yeah. And then my middle name is Alan. Sue had a schnauzer. Did he really? What happened to the schnauzer? Little Max. I thought he was schnauzer. Schnauzer. Do you know how to say, um, it's that dog that starts with a D? It looks like bun at the end. Bun? Datsun? Datsun? Oh. Oh no. A wiener dog. That is like the name of the breed is Datsun. It's German. Of course it is. <laughs> he lived to be 14 years old. Oh my gosh. My Chihuahua this year in March will be 16. How they have a Persian cat in Max? A Persian cat? Meow. Yeah. Did it have a lot of hair? We have things in common. I like, I like it. So it just looks so natural, huh? Yeah. And to do that, you want to leave a little bit of space so that way the vet can go in there and really clean everything out. And, and these, do your, sorry, do your like nails not grow faster, but like like a fill? Yeah. I would say a fill for you would be anywhere between 14 and 21 days. This is my nephew's son. Mine's 
My Chihuahua will be 17 as well. And we're all over you, Bella. Aww. Does she still have all her teeth? <laughs> Malibu has none of her teeth. Really? My dog too. My mom had her teeth taken out. She has a like, little tug. Hey, Aww. Out. How many dogs do you guys have? Four. Four? No. Yes. So there's Malibu and Modelo. Malibu, Modelo, Martini, and Bacardi. Why are they all alcohol related names? Um, I'm just starting. Oh, okay. And then when we got Bacardi, I wanted to name her Mimosa. Mm hmm. And like, I want to give her like a classy drink. Yeah, like Mimi. But then they named it Bacardi. I was like, the M. We're sticking with the M. A theme. Like, they didn't really get it until I named Modelo. Mm -hmm. And they're like, oh, I was like, yeah, now it's too late. You guys screwed up the, the, yeah. the process. Yeah. So now you need another dog. I Do think, you want another one? Yeah, my next one's gonna be Moscato. Moscato? Mm -hmm. Isn't that a wine? Yeah. Is it good? I have no idea. You should name one Martini. You're like, I'm not gonna. Uh, um, what is Martini? Martini? Yeah. What do you mean, what is it? No, like one of the dogs' name is Martini. Oh, you have a Martini already? Yeah. Oh. Now it'll be Martini, Modelo, and then it was going to be Mimosa, but then it'll be Bacardi instead. Get the road, Gloria. A bailar. Bueno, nos vemos mañana con el poder de Dios. No vayas a pistear mucho. My animals' names after gods or goddesses, animal characters, animal. anime characters, or movie characters. Our current pup is. I don't know how to say that. Alina. Name after the battle angel. Is that a show? <laughs> no idea. So my dogs are my my dog that's going to be 16. Her name is Milen. Farmer. <laughs> she has a first and a last name. And um, Milen Farmer is like the French Madonna. Mm. And then my other uh, dog, the female, her name is Peaches. And she, her name is Peaches because her nose is like a little peach. Mm -hmm. And also there's a rapper named Peaches that I like. <laughs> and then my other dog, the, the black one that looks like my dad, his name is Machi. But we call him the gentleman. And Machi... The little naked one? Yeah. The hairless one? Uh-huh. And Machi was my dad's nickname as a boy. Okay. So I named it after him. Because it looks just like him. It's dark and wrinkly. <laughs> So now you guys already know that the French nails and the ombre nails, you cannot buff the top surface. So all you do is you take nail prep and we're going to cleanse the top surface of the nail. That's what I, am I saying that right, Alita? Yes. Okay. Isn't Alita a, a rocker from the 80s? She sang that song, went to a party last Saturday night. I did in something, I got in a fight, uh-huh. It ain't no big thing. <laughs> Had to borrow 10 bucks from my old man, uh-huh. But I know what I like. I know I like dancing with you. This is Shiny Star. Star Bright. You would think I'm like a rock from the 80s, huh? Send that song. You're like, Max, where's that song? <laughs> One thing. Um, she said, and that's not Alita. Ailey, I, Ailey, yeah. <laughs> he said, that's just Leah Ford. Oh, that's a Tony's homegirl. Look how pretty that looks. A, not A. Alita. Alita. <laughs> Beautiful. Now. A liter. A liter forward. I love the glitter. That's so cute. So cute, huh? Even just like that, it looks really pretty. Mm -hmm. But it is a max video and we gotta go hard. It is a max video. We're gonna bake that for 30 seconds. In my heart. Ah, uh, oh my gosh. What? <laughs> She's trying to describe how to say this word. Oh, the dog. Okay, it's the long A vowel sound. It's long. Oh 
Oh my gosh, that sounds like Wheel of Fortune. Uh, uh, or ah. Ah, Lita, a Lita, a Lita. What's her last name? La Lita. Lolita. No, oh, man. Not a Lita. A Lita? <laughs> I'm losing my mind. <laughs> You're like, this is way too much. I just sent it for this match. A lot? A lot? Yes. A. A Lita. This is the official song of Australia. Kylie Minogue and Jason Donovan, especially for you. My love never changed. Apple. Take a short round. Aiden is the longest. Oh. <laughs> oh, wait. A So this is Maxi Pop, Maxi Pop set three. Which one do you like? We have this like gummy bear. I like the Christmas underwear. We have the rabbit. We have a little lamb chops play along. We have a little pink bear right there too. Which one do you like? That one? You got it. And we're gonna glue him with Squeezie. My heart is so, so true. This song, I wanted to sing karaoke in Australia. That was like on my bucket list. Why didn't you? I did. You did? I did. There's not that much left on my bucket list, actually. Do you have a bucket list? Nope. No? I just got you, There's nothing you want to do before you die? Well, like travel. Well, to where? Dubai. Really? Yeah. Why? I've always wanted to go to Dubai for New Year's. Really? Have you seen their New Year's? Yes. Uh, but I don't think Dubai is that pretty. I've never been there, but like the skyline and things like that, I think it, eh. If you want a really beautiful skyline at night, Hong Kong and Shanghai. Like Shanghai is like being in Blade Runner, like it's the future. It's so cool. But Dubai, I think it's a little played out too much. But have you seen the New Year special? Mm-hmm. With like the drones and the fireworks? You can do that in Vegas. Uh, Vegas? Yeah. With, with little... Unity cards while you're trying to enjoy the fireworks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. I used to, you know, like for cheer, we would always go there. Mm -hmm. And I was all of like 10 years old going to Vegas. 10 year old has no business being in Vegas. Walking around the strip with all the nudie well, cards. Yeah, all the nudie cards. And that's why we have a nun with hard tests on. Like, Mom, what's going on? You're like, this place is not kosher. No. And your mom's like, She's like, enjoy it. She's, she's like, just don't look. <laughs> and like, you know, I'm a kid, so I'm staring. You look even harder. Yes. I'm and like, then like, everything is so bright and colorful. <laughs> and you're like, her nipple tassels are like, <laughs> like iridescent. I can't stop not looking. I have to show you the assless twerker that I saw in Vegas. An assless twerker? Yeah, it was like, it was sad, but anything <laughs> for money, apparently. No shame in her game or his game. I don't know what it was. A non-binary person. Because <laughs> they were scary looking. It looked like Buffalo Bill, but like... <laughs> Buffalo Bill now, like after... <laughs> he's been found after a week of being locked. You see everything in Vegas. Max, you're all... But you know what? In New York, no matter how bad you look, there's always going to be somebody looking worse than you on the street in New York. How funny. Hey, what's on your bucket list? Oh, Dubai, get a new bucket list. How am I Uh, I lived in Vegas for my candy first, second grade. Circus Circus with my jam. Circus Circus was my favorite. Oh my god, Circus Circus is like a crack hotel. That place is, is disgusting. <laughs> it is a crack hotel, but I never stayed at... Like, I never stayed. It even stinks. There, I've always went for like the roller coasters and all of that. Oh my gosh, the two roller coasters that you need a chiropractor after? Literally. They're so bad. And the Circus Circus stinks. Ugh. That place is not kosher. So, a uh, lady said these gems are so pretty, but they catch on everything. They do not. Because, Actually. because we shrink wrap the entire nail in gel after. And that creates kind of like a vortex around it. So, it will not go anywhere. So, while she's twerking upside down, <laughs> Spinning it, throwing it, whipping her hair back and forth. These diamonds are not going to get tangled in anything, my love. Trust the process. The devil works hard, but Max works harder. But be careful, Max. My youngest is part of that community. Of oh, which one? Yeah. 
that is a true New Yorker. I mean, that is, that is true as a New Yorker. I lived there back in the late 70s, 70s. Very recent. And it is a scary Mary. The LGBTQ plus community. The rainbows. We love all the colors of the rainbow here at Hinoka Shore. That. Isn't that like candy? We're also going to go in with liquid gummy around the bigger ones just to give it a little bit more, a little more hold. Proud Rainbow Mom here. Well, that is so important. I think that she is a super supportive parent, and hats off to her. I love the speed up version of these. It's so important, I think, for young people to have the support of their family, and you know, shout out to her. Let me see that ring finger. That's, I was gonna say that's good. I guess so. That's a good age to have children. Yeah. How old are you? Oh, that's old for some people. By 20, they already have like four. Yeah, I don't want to have one. But I also feel like I also feel like big families are not as like popular as they used to be. Yeah. I need to have kids. I like that. How old was she? Oh, that's a good age. I need to have a kid for tax purposes. <laughs> I can name it IRS. It's <laughs> been like so exhausted and I didn't do anything today. Just party? No. Just ate a lot What'd you watch in Netflix? Gina and Georgia. What's that? Um it's, I don't know, like a little, like a troubled relationship between a mom and a daughter, but then the mom like grew up all like all crazy and she's experienced a lot of things and she like has a hidden past and all that, so it's like unwrapping her crazy mm -hmm. past. Have you seen Squid Games? Yeah. Is that good? Yeah. I was kind of scared because like a lot of people, like me, I can't, like, I don't know what it is, if their lips don't match, like, like the words, uh -huh. I get super annoyed. You're like, oh, turn it off. Yes, like, and you can tell they're voice actors, like, it's not their actual voice. It doesn't even, like, match with whatever match. you're watching. Yeah, so I'm like, I can't watch this. But, like, with the Squid Game, it was totally different. At that, oh, these nails are delicious. This is the official theme song of the 1984 Olympics. Lavender. I think one of them died or something. Really? Of the Pointer Sisters. The drummer from Earth, Wind, Fireline. Really? When? What about that footballer everybody was like, he got hurt um, playing the game. Is but he okay? He had a seizure? Yes. Oh, he had a seizure? I think so. I thought he got hit too hard. Yeah, like hit too hard and gave him a seizure. Oh. Yeah. I grew up watching Japanese movies like Godzilla and Ultraman. I told, I'm totally used to it. And my daughter can speak Japanese and prefers to watch an anime with no subtitles. Oh, good heaven. <laughs> She's like, I want to... I want to be, I want to feel like I'm in Japan. Whoops. Oh, he had a heart attack. Please don't die. I think he's okay. No, he had a heart attack. His heart stopped. But I'm thinking of the wrong player, because one of the, one of, I don't know what player it is then. 
that he um, he like got hit and he went to go stand up. Mm -hmm. And then he like collapsed and started seizing. I think I'm talking about the one that was in the Buffalo Bills game. Yeah, they're saying like um. Heart attack. Little cardiac arrest. Lincoln has been asking about the game now. That's charming. What a team player. Go ahead and put that in for me. 30 seconds. He woke up with, yeah, and asked. He's like, Where's, how's the game? I think I saw a post about that. Like, you won. You won the game of life. Something. For real. He's really lucky. The mm -hmm. Lord was benefit. Beneficial? He was really lucky the Lord gave him a second chance. Because yeah. he got peace out. Yes. But I guess you know that's one of the occupational job hazards. Really? Yeah, playing football. So I think that's why they make so much money in like a short amount of time because like they can't really play football for that long. For that long? I think any pro athlete, right? Yeah. I think so. Exactly. But Michael, I feel like Michael Jordan played basketball for like a really long time. Yeah. There's an excellent article explaining what actually happened. It's literally, it was once in a never happen again at birthday. Let me take it out now. So we are going to go in with liquid gummy. And I'm going to fill in any gaps you might have. And this is going to begin to seal the diamonds around the edges so that way nothing gets tangled. So this is one of the little tricks of the trade. And it has this really dope needle point applicator. Incredible. Have you heard of people like taking professional wedding pictures and videos with their phone? No. They were telling me that yesterday here on Facebook Live that like people will <laughs> charge you like a regular price, like a very expensive price to take pictures and videos of your phone and they do it with an iPhone of your wedding. Yeah. I'm gonna bake that for a minute. Oh, brown face. Can you come here for a sec? Look. Where are you? Oh, here, I'm gonna screenshot it for you. And then I need you to call and set up an appointment for a bit. Mm-hmm. No, it's uh, great. No, because I just got the technology right now. Tomorrow. Oh, this is me after uh, Christmas and New Year's. <laughs> Literally. That's how I feel. <laughs> I'm not sure what it is. Yeah, it's great. It's right there on the thing. It says reference number. Okay. Are these the party presents? No. Who's that? No, no, no. These are, uh, I want you to go French ombre. Pick it up. So now we're going to seal everything with shiny. And this is the secret. We're going to shrink wrap all those diamonds and charms onto the nail.
do a lot of like the press on ones. Mm. Like, Me? Um, only for my live stream. The press on ones? Yes, I do. I try to mix up all of our products uh -huh. so that way I can showcase everything. Yeah. But I don't necessarily do one style of nail more than the other. Maybe the one, two, three, go for sure. Yeah. But uh, I don't think I necessarily do one more, one style of nail more than the other for 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 like personal preference or anything like that. Because I like any product that I make. If not, I wouldn't make it. Dominic's nails. So nice. Hello, my love. You saying I'm still waiting for my bottle of water? So pretty! Oh, have you had the uh, Korean corn dogs yet? You haven't had the two hands corn dogs? Yes, I have. Oh, they're so good. I'm gonna go um, for one now. I've tried it and then I have like a whole one. I don't think I can eat one though, to be honest with you. <laughs> because my teeth are gonna fall out. Because you guys know I told you that one of my teeth fell out the Friday before New Year's Eve. And then they didn't put it back in until this Tuesday, and the dentist was like, you need a, a post put in. So I'm like, great. I have to like literally eat like tofu and scrambled eggs for the rest of my life. <laughs> Beautiful. Let's go ahead and bake this for one whole minute. I'm trying to find that picture. I have too many darn pictures on my telephone. Nice. What? No, no what? I don't know what's up with that word. Moist. Nice. Like it's uh, no. Why? It's, just, it's, it's the texture. A nasty word. What do you use for a cake that's nasty. juicy? Juicy. A cake is not juicy. Juicy is liquid. A cake can't be juicy. No, a cake is moist. Uh, <laughs> no. That is such a like a. Mm. It's just I don't know what it is with me and that word. And it's not just me. There's a lot of people that don't like that. There's word. a lot of women that don't like that word. It's I don't know like, why. More, like it's a more like <laughs> <laughs> I used to have one that hated the word penetrate. <laughs> <laughs> She's like that's such a nasty why people use that word all the time. The cuticle oil penetrates the skin. See penetrate doesn't really do much for me. But the cuticle oil keeps the skin moist. It's the moist, it's not the tea, it's moist like moist. moist. I don't know. <gasps> Oh, that's funny. Boy, that, no, no, no. My nana even always say it around the house. She said, yeah. <laughs> like, shut! I hated it so much. Let's take these off the little tripod. Look at Robin. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you girls are savages. Mm. Oh, look at that. Come through, Harajuku Barbie. Well, my loves, that's going to wrap up our little demo for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And what can I say? I love you guys so much. Stay safe, stay out of trouble. And we will see you tomorrow in the next live video. Bye, everybody.